Somalia bore the brunt of the flash floods that inundated the Horn of Africa region. The National Disaster Management Agency said 51 people had died across the country, and half a million had been displaced since the rains began in October. Emergency workers fear the death toll could rise as many people remain missing. Parts of the country remained isolated and inaccessible after roads and bridges were washed away, leaving thousands of residents stranded. The National Army has sent rescue ships and emergency helicopters to help people trapped by the floods. We are asking for international help. The National Disaster Management Agency said. The aid group Save the Children said the town of Beladwain in central Somalia was completely submerged after the Shabel River burst its banks, forcing around 250,000 people, or 90% of the population, to flee their homes. Somalia's federal government declared a state of emergency last month after extreme weather, exacerbated by the natural weather phenomenon El Nino, destroyed homes, roads and bridges. A warmer atmosphere due to human-caused climate change can also hold more water, making downpours more intense. I in neighboring Kenya, the Kenya Red Cross said hundreds of homes were raised along the coast and in northern Kenya, killing more than 50 people and forcing at least 30,000 from their homes. Mandera, Wager and Tana River counties, where large areas of land were submerged, were the hardest hit. Mandera, which is 20 times the size of London and borders Somalia, is one of Kenya's poorest areas. Tana River County Commissioner Mohamed Noor said the situation was also desperate in his region, where floods had displaced around 7,000 families. We asked for urgent help from Nairobi. Food has to be airlifted to these suffering people because from the Tanner River to Garson, the roads are impassable and we cannot reach many people," Noor said. Ethiopian authorities said the country's flood death toll had reached 30 after. Incessant rains in Gambela, Afar and Somalia regions. They said the victims included children who drowned while trying to escape the flood waters. Scientists say climate change has worsened extreme weather events from heat to drought and floods around the world including in the Horn of Africa, where just a few months ago, parts of Ethiopia, Kenya, Somalia and South Sudan they experienced the worst drought in 40 years after five failed rainy seasons. For more news like this across the globe, please subscribe to our channel, like and share this video. Thank you.